Hi everyone, it's Agnieszka Murdoch. Welcome to English with Aga. This video is about the passive voice in the present tense. So we will look at things like is done, are done, gets done, get done, getting done, being done and so on. We will also do a practice exercise at the end, so keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe and download your free English grammar booklet from the video description. Are you ready? Let's get started. This is my favorite bakery and a cake is made there every day. It means somebody makes the cake. But the passive voice is not about the person who does the action. It's about the object. And that's why it's the passive voice. So I'm not talking about the chef. I'm talking about the cake, the object of the action. A cake is made. As you can see, we have is and made. So for the passive voice, you need is and the past participle or the third form of the verb. Many cakes are made at this bakery every day. This is plural, so we need are. Cakes are made. So in the present tense, to make a passive sentence, you need is or are and the past participle. You can also say a cake gets made. That has the same meaning as is made. So you can say a cake is made or a cake gets made every day. Dinner is being prepared right now. It means somebody is preparing dinner. So this version of the passive voice is in the present continuous tense. Somebody is preparing dinner. Dinner is being prepared. So in the present continuous we need is, the third form, the past participle, but we also need being. So dinner is being prepared. I can also use getting. My car is getting washed right now. Somebody is washing it. So you can use being or getting. You can also use the passive voice with different modal verbs. So you can use it with must, for example. Homework must be submitted every week. It must be submitted. So here you haven't got is, you've got must be and the past participle. Dinner must be prepared every day. My car must be inspected every year. You can also use need to. My dog needs to be walked every day. It means somebody needs to walk my dog and my dog needs to be walked. Keys can be collected at reception. It means you can collect keys at reception. So you can also use can be plus past participle. Now let's do a practice exercise. Turn these active sentences into the passive voice. We cook the cauliflower until it's crisp. What should it be in the passive voice? The cauliflower is cooked until it's crisp. One of my colleagues has finished the report and it's ready to be submitted. The report has been finished and it's ready to be submitted. Someone is preparing the dinner and it will be ready in a few minutes. The dinner is being prepared and it will be ready in a few minutes. Someone is preparing the room for the guest's arrival. The room is being prepared 
for the guest's arrival. Somebody is washing my car at the car wash right now. My car is being washed at the car wash right now. You should read instructions carefully before assembling furniture. Instructions should be read carefully before assembling furniture. How many did you get right? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe and get your free English grammar booklet from the video description. I'll see you next time. Bye!